in this video uh, we will see uh, some of the important functions in APL so here I'll, I'll show you like how to delete an object so here this is our object so I'll be deleting this wait before deleting like I'll be showing you something how to create an expression rule how to copy an expression rule so let's suppose this is uh, I'll be creating an expression rule so creating a new one it's easy I'll, be, uh, I'll show you once again so here I'll be creating a duplicate for duplicate you need to provide one name from which you want to copy so this is uh, dupli I'm duplicating it so name should uh, be unique so I'll be creating uh, test so here is uh, like one duplicate I'll be creating and click on create so you can see a new expression rule will be created having the same value as we had like in existing one so this is like empty one in previous also we do not have any value so here uh, like uh, first we will be seeing like how to uh, some some of the functions uh, which is mostly asked in uh, interview first uh, interview question the most ask is like difference function so i'll be writing like this difference in this difference like we, we it is asking you can see here the details array one and array two and you can uh, read the description it returns value in array one and not in array two so here what i'll be writing i'll be writing two array then 20 30 this is one array so put comma and write second array that is 20 30 40 50 60 70 so these are two array and i'll be testing it so the result would be 10 because it returns a value in array and one and not the array in two so you can see 20 and 30 it already there in like array two so if i'll be testing it then you can see 10 as a result let's suppose we have an array and we do not have like common value let's suppose here what i'll be typing is again and to comment this to format this first select this and click on format it will be formatted and to comment this select this and you can write you can click here it will be commented so what i'll be checking one one uh, one more thing in differences the same uh, like I'll be using and to uncomment this select this and again click on this icon icon it is uncommented so we are going to check this now you can see no none of the values are common between the two both the arrays are different so what it will result is it will uh, result uh, like whole array array one uh, sorry uh, one two three complete this so this is uh, about the now uh, i'll be commenting this and after that we are uh, like going for next function that is symmetric difference so here if you write this is symmetric difference symmetric difference again we have to provide array one and array two and the result would be different here it will provide what is unique between the two array unique between let's suppose i'll be this two two array i'll be uh, copying this and pasting it here so whatever common between the two it is going to neglect the common between the two and whatever the unique uh, we have in both the array that is our result so you can see here 10 10 then 40 then 50 then 60 then 70 you you, you can see the result let's suppose we do not have anything common and what if we have all the thing common so i'll be commenting this and again i'll be uh, showing a result which is like all common let's suppose we have like all common results all common this is all common so here the result is nothing again let us check like for difference also if we have like all results common You can also remove the comment like this and if we have like all common then what it returns c 
see here also like it it, uh, it returns uh, like null now what we will see is next function null uh, index so in the index like we have like data data in the form of array let's suppose this is array i'm taking in the array if i have to search some of the index let's suppose i have to search on index index number 3 that is 40 and by default value this is like default in in the if it if if index num if index 3 does not exist then what would be our uh, like by default result then by default result i want to return 2000 so let's suppose 3 it has it will return some data because it has like some data you can see it uh, index number 1 2 and 3 at 3 pl third place we have like 40 so 40 is reflecting over here let's suppose we have like how many indexes we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 index we have i'm typing 9 so our result would 9 does not exist in this array so result would be 2000 that is by default what if again i'm uh, like commenting this one more thing i'll be typing is sorry here if i'm typing something a b c d it will result null why it has not result a b c d because it is of not type this it should be of same type here if i'll type something 89 then it will result 89 so this is about index function so now the next function is uh, like mod function modulus function so type mod so in in the modulus function what you can see is dividend dividend uh, you can write uh, some one array you can write here let's suppose i have written uh, like uh, uh, sorry 21 22 23 24 and 25 like five uh, five data i have entered in this uh, array and after that like it is asking for divisor so what divisor i'll be writing is 2 so what this result gave so we divide like how much is the reminder so here it will give reminder 1 here it will give reminder 0 reminder 1 reminder 0 reminder 1 you can see the same result over here and now again one more thing i'll be uh, writing uh, i'll be uh, showing like where function i'll be using this mod in where function so where function uh, like it is asking for boolean array so one zero one zero this is boolean only one means true zero means false so it is asking like boolean array so i'll be writing this inside this array mod so and after that uh, like i'll be checking like which is uh, like what i'll be comparing so i'll be uh, like marking this is equals to zero where it is uh, like zero default value you can you can write it so if you test it it is not giving any result do you know why because like two functions are together just a minute let me comment it now it will result so you can see like second place and fourth place we have the correct value see this is first place this is second place this is third fourth fifth place if you divide 22 by 2 then what would be reminder it's 0 then here it is 0 is equals to 0 which place it is 0 then at index number 2 it is 0 index number 4 it is 0 let's suppose i'll be writing here so here you can see index number 2 index number 3 what well, let, let me uh, like populate this if you have to populate both the result then what you will do you can put it in this uh, flower bracket that is in the form of array so if you keep it in array format you, then you can see first result as a modulus one zero one zero one one five five and then you can see at second place index number two is zero index number four is zero now what i'll be doing is here i'll be putting one which one is true so here it will give index number 1.